if you have a low end or budget pc and you are getting low fps fps drops and stutters while you play games so guys this video is going to help you to getting the more performance and fixing all these problems on your any pc in any game so guys welcome to my channel if this is your first time here please subscribe drop a like and let's get straight into over this video so guys in the very first step we are going to disable dynamic tick that is the high precision even timer and this will help us to improving our performance in some cases by allowing the cpu to run more efficiently during gaming so guys for that you need to go for your window search search for cmd and make sure to run this as administrator now hit yes so guys now simply copy the command from the description of my this video paste it here and press enter and the operation completed successfully and this will guys help you to getting the more performance by disabling the dynamic tick high precision event timer now the next step we are going to use our large term cache for gaming and by enabling the settings you can allow windows to prioritize gaming workload and improve your disk caching problem while gaming so guys for that you need to again go for your window search search for registry and open up registry editor as the administrator now you have to copy the path of the registry from the description of my this video simply paste it here and press enter once you are here in this directory now you need to find out here this last term cache registry double tap here and go for the value data and you need to change this value data from zero to one for enabling this option after that set the base on the hexadecimal and hit ok and close out of your registry editor now the next step we are going to enable the msi mode on our gpu and guys for doing it you need to download this optimization pack on your pc which include msi power control pc digital optimization and the gear up booster you can download this link you can download this pack from the link in the description simply go there and download this pack on your pc so once you download now extract it and here you will find out this msi utility v3 zip file so double tap here now you need to drag this application on your desktop and replace the file destination so guys here we got over this msi so right click here and now make sure to run this as administrator therefore we can properly use this application so run this as administrator now hit yes and here you will find out this from the interface now select out here your gpu whatever you are using amd or nvidia now you need to go for this msi and check mark on this box for enabling the msi feature for your gpu now you need to go for interrupt priority Go for this drop down and set it onto the high now click on this apply button and guys that's it now close out of your msi now for the next step you need to install the power control on your pc for enabling all cpu cores simply double tap here and install this application i am using the power control from a long time so guys this is one of the best application for optimizing your cpu so guys you need to simply open up the power control now here you will find out cpu settings for the power profile Go for the drop down and set it on to the bit some highest performance. Everything not available inside this list, so guys, go for it and install the bit some plan on your PC. I have already installed it. Now click on this make activate. Now you have to turn off the setting from here that is the parking and set the settings onto the 100%. Now go for short thread and long thread and also follow the same settings. Now here on the right side, you will find out the setting for your laptop, so guys, set it onto the off set the parking onto the 100% now go for heterogeneous policy long and short thread and use the same settings on your laptop this will guys enable all your cp cores for the best performance now click on the supply button and guys hit ok and this application will keep running in your background whenever you turn on your pc now for the next step we are going to optimize our windows registry settings so open up this folder and here you will find that your cpu settings your gpu your scheduling category ffi or purity and system responsiveness you need to simply install all the registries on your pc one by one it is guys completely safe i take 100 percent guarantee of it so don't worry about anything simply double tap here hit yes hit yes again click ok and guys install all the registries on your pc now here in the last step you will find out this gear up boost application so open up this txt file inside you will find out this copy and search this link in the browser so you need to copy this link from here and press ctrl c for copying it and here you will find out this free trial code for the gear up booster and one of the luckiest person can avail or redeem this code for getting 15 days more trial on the gear up booster so once you copy this link from here now you need to open up your any browser so once you search the link in your browser here you will find out download for windows so click here and download this tool on your pc 
After installation, here you will find out this kind of the interface of the Gear Booster. And guys, you can simply log in here your account using your email, your Google ID, or your Facebook ID. So now you need to go for your Fortnite or whatever game in which you want to optimize your ping. You can go for the Games tab, and here you will find a thousand of the game. So you need to go for your home tab and you will find out the install game automatically. Now click on this boost button and guys this will start optimizing the network for you with the best routing. So guys once you are connected with the gear up booster here you will find out this kind of the region and guys here kind of the node. So this will guys automatically find everything for you. You do not have to change anything from here. So guys click on this launch game button and guys make sure to launch your game after launching the gear up booster so guys here once you have launched the fortnite on your pc now you need to open up your gear up booster and here you can check out here your estimated ping and guys every single thing now here is the routing detail you can check out here my pc that is connected with the gear up booster and then gear up booster is connected with the dubai server and then here it is the adaptive intelligent routing that is automatically find out the best ping for you and optimize your route for getting the best performance for the network so guys now the next step we are going to optimize our fortnite or any other game settings so guys for that you need to open up the file explorer now go for the drive where you install your dead specific game so i want to do it for my fortnite so i will go in my local dixie program file epic game fortnite Fortnite game folder, binary, win64, and here you will find out this Fortnite client win64shipping.exe file. So right click here and go into the properties. Now go for compatibility, check mark on the disable full screen optimization, and go for change high DPI and also check mark on the override high DPI scaling behavior. Now hit OK, hit apply and click OK and close out of this folder. Now in the next step, we are going to increase our CPU purity for game. This is the registry hack. So guys, this will help you to run your game on high CPU purity that can ensure more resources are allocated to the game rather than background task. So for that, you need to open up registry editor. Make sure to run this as administrator and hit yes. Now you have to copy the path from the description of this video, go for the search bar, paste it here and press enter. So guys, once you are here now in the very first step, you need to find out here your game name. So guys, I want to optimize my Fortnite. So here I got my Fortnite. But guys, if you not find out your game inside this list, so you need to simply right click here, go for D word 32 bit value and guys paste here the launcher file name on the folder name. So now inside this folder, right click here, go for new and go for D word 32 bit value. Now you need to guys name it like CPU purity class and make sure to use the same capitalization. Now hit enter. Now double tap here and now you need to change this value data. Now you need to change this value data onto the three for setting your dead specific game on the high priority of your CPU. Now set the base on the hexadecimal and hit OK and close out of your registry editor. Now in the next step, we are going to adjust our GPU QO size for the low end GPU and this can work on your NVIDIA GPU. This will guys allow your NVIDIA GPU to use a render frame queue to store more frame before they are displayed. And guys also by increasing the queue size can reduce your CPU bottleneck. So guys for that simply right click on your desktop, open up NVIDIA control panel. Now you need to go for manage 3 settings. Now you need to scroll all the way down and here you will find out this virtual reality pre-render frame. So guys go for it and now you need to change this number onto the 3 for better frame queuing on our budget GPU. So guys, simply set it onto the 3 after that click on the supply button and apply these changes inside your NVIDIA control panel. Now simply close out of your NVIDIA control panel. So guys, that's it for this video. I hope so you love this optimization for your budget or low-end PC in order to get the best performance for gaming. Please make sure to let me know your opinion about this video in the comment below. And guys, see you again in the next video.